Get ready for the most stubborn racist guy that's ever owned a business. I had to call the local news station about him by the end of this. Mother, you car, you tow my car. Oh, I did. I don't know who do it, but somebody take car, they tow it. Oh, well, it must be me. What's I that? want my car back. Okay, come get it. What do you mean? Come bring it to me. <laughs> yeah, right. Bring it to you. <laughs> get off your fat ass and bring it to me. Whoa, whoa, easy there, young man. Yeah. <laughs> How do you know I got a fat ass? I can hear your fat jiggling down the esophagus right now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> exactly right. Okay, look. When can you tow it back over here? We don't tow cars back over anywhere. But you only tow it two, not two two. Okay, whatever. I want to talk to manager, please. Hello, hello. Oh my God! I will show them my wrath. <laughs> uh, hello, I believe telephone got disconnected. I talked to one guy right now. He's not very nice to me. Okay, it was me. Okay, can I talk to manager, please? Yeah, hang on. All right. Hello. Basically, what happened here? Somebody took my car, and I wanted to bring it back right now. When? Yeah, uh, it, it it was taken yesterday. I asked my friend what happened. I left it there overnight, and he tell me, "Oh, tow truck, come take it." Okay, you gotta come down here and pay the charges, and then you can drive it away. But why can you not bring it back? Right, you took it, put it back where you found it. No, we don't do that. You gotta come back here and pay the charges, and then you can drive the car away. Okay, look, Mother Yakar, how much charge is that? What kind of car did you have? Honda. What's your license plate? Oh, license plate. Jamila, what is license plate number? Uh, she's looking it up right now. But can you bring it back? No, we don't bring them back. But but uh, why not? Because we don't. There'll be another charge for that. Okay, what is charge for that? Well, let's find out. Because I'm not showing any Honda in the book. So but I need a license the, the the what the price changing depending on who car or what? If I have a rich car, you charge me more money or what? No, it's all the same price. Okay, so what is the cost? I'm looking for your plate number. Look, Mother Yakar, you tell me it's all the same price. I'm asking you, what is the price? I want your plate number to see if I got the car to start oh. with. Okay. All right. Can I talk to somebody not stupid, please? I would appreciate. Uh, that that is you. You are the stupid one. No, you are so, you are stupid, Mother Ugly. Uh, right? I ask you, what is the cost? You're acting like stupid man, what right? Is, what is, what does your mother look like? A dot head? A what? <laughs> it's what? <laughs> Let the games begin. You can't be racist towards Rockish. <laughs> Hello, do you hang up on me? Yes, we have to hang up on you. You, you talk you a shit, right? A number, you talk please. a shit about my mother, right? And then you tell me, oh, I have to hang up, right? No. You tell me, oh, you have a dot head, I don't know, whatever, and then you hang up, okay? Don't act. You, I know you're stupid, but don't be that stupid, okay? Genius. Hello? <laughs> Hello. My roommate, Rockies, just called y'all right now. He he was talking to me, telling me, like, oh, they, they were pulling the race car, be a racist towards me, and be mean and stuff. I don't know what's happening right now, but he's real upset. Oh, I don't know. Well, okay, tell me this. Did, did you call him a diehead? Because that's what he told me. No, no, I didn't call him that. So you, you did not say that, right? I don't even know him. No, I didn't say that. Okay, so you did not say the words, you, you are, what are you, a diehead or something? Right. What kind of comments you picking? No, why you going to lie to me, dog? Why are you go? So you go, okay, first of all, are you going to give him a free pickup? Because that's some fucked up shit, man. To, 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 to stoop to that. No, no that. well, you know what? Call, call, look, call the police, okay? Okay, so how about I call the news station and, and play back you calling him a dothead? How about that? Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. Okay, Whatever. So, so, so you embracing the fact that you a racist ass bitch, right? No, why are you swearing to me, sir? Don't swear at me. Boy, kiss my motherfucking ass. I mean, you know what you said to him? Are you playing dumb, dog? You playing motherfucking dumb, and you know it. Hello? <laughs> what does your mother look like? A dothead? A what? Hello? What? Hello? Uh, yeah, did what that sound that? Did that sound right to you? What does that mean? Don, I don't even know what that means. Okay. Obviously, y'all making some type of reference to his culture, some like that. Now, come on, man, don't play dumb. We don't even, we don't even know who he is. How can we make fun of anybody's culture? When okay, we don't know who all right. Is? Let me speak with the manager, please. Sure, hang on. Hello, may I help you? 
Uh, yeah, hello. Uh, I, I was speaking yeah. to somebody a little while ago. Uh, my roommate, uh, Rockish, was talking to somebody who was saying racial slurs towards him. Can you tell me who, who, is, who is this individual? What, is, what does your mother look like? A dothead? A what? I'm getting, I'm getting a bunch of mix. I can't quite make out who's talking or what. Okay. Sounds like it's more than one people. No, no, no. Uh, listen, listen to what's being said here, okay? Pause for a second. What does your mother look like? A dothead? A what? So, yeah, that, that's what happened. And now we're looking for an apology and figure out what's going on here and, and on what universe is that acceptable? I, I don't even know what you're talking about. <laughs> I'm not sure. Ooh. Okay, look. We, we yeah. know for a fact somebody there... Refer to him, what is your mama, a dot head, then hung up, okay? Now we got a bunch of people playing dumb. I'm about to hit up the news station, see what's popping with you and your racist organization over there, okay? I, I don't, to start with, I don't know what you're talking about. Simply cannot pass the phone to the person who said it and ask them to say sorry. Is that I don't difficult? know who said it. Okay, let me... I am, I am apologizing to you to end this, uh, whatever issue is. But Doug, why are you like I don't understand. Doug. I can't believe like like my mind is blown right now that any businessman would choose to like have that kind of thing in their record and be so stubborn about like some race that that's serious. Doug. I don't know about you, but like nowadays you can't be saying that stuff to people. Maybe like a hundred years ago you could be dropping them racial slurs on people and stuff, but not nowadays. Right. Tell me this, my man. Like, yeah. can we go ahead and stop playing games and just acknowledge the fact that you kind of said something mean to my boy? No one here said anything mean to your boy. Oh, dog, you still gonna lie to me, man? Come on, man. I, I, I played the recording to you like 15 times, man. You gonna lie to me like that? Why, man? Why? I don't understand. I understand you're trying to cover your ass and stuff, but like sometimes you just gotta man up to it, dog. No, no one here. That's not what we're about. Hello? Look, somebody talked to me and they said the wrong thing, okay? I don't know what happened here, but it hurt my feeling, right? Well, if somebody hurt your feelings, I'm sorry to hear that. Mother Clucker, uh, I know it was you, okay? Somebody tell me, oh, dotty, dotty, right, hoppity, hippities. So, so why are you swearing, then? I don't, I, I, I said Mother Yucker, that is not swear, okay? Okay, well, it sounds like you swore. But I say Mother Yucker, okay? It is not. But somebody tell me, oh, dotty, dotty, mommy, dotty, right, hippity, hoppities. I think it was you, man. All right, well, but, at this point in time, your car is not here, so... Okay. I would check with the police, all right? But are you are you sorry, racist man? Oh, no, nope, I'm not a racist, so you are a, I have nothing to be look, sorry about. But, but look. What, is, what does your mother look like? A dothead? Somebody, somebody t say things to me, right? Well, no, whoever, uh, no one should have said anything bad to you, and no matter where you are in the world. How's that? But that is right. But to compensate me, will you tow me a car or something? No. But you're, will, you, will you tow for free one time? No, we don't tow for free. But but you insult for free, right? No, no one insults for free or charges for free insulting. No one insults. That guy did he did insulting to me. Well, I don't know what you're talking about, but Mother like Yakara, I told I told your friend Tyrone check with the police department. They'll tell you who has your car. Okay, okay. Mother Yakar, I hope you burn it in the hellfire. But okay. Okay. Bye now. Mother bitch. <laughs> Uh, hello, can I speak with uh, manager, please? Uh, speaking, you got him. Okay, hello. My name is Abdu. I'm calling from uh, Al Jazeera English in coordination with NBC Local News. How are you doing, sir? Okay. Excellent. So I uh, we had like a, a correspondence with one guy who sent us a package here envelope with one VHS cassette and the Walkman in, uh, with some content on it that we found a little bit surprised. It seems like uh, one manager there was saying racial slur to uh, one Indian guy. So we're coming now for interview. We just want to make sure that this is a good time and what is the status. You're coming where for an interview? To the tow truck company. Okay, for, for what, a job, a position? No, for an interview for Al Jazeera English and with, in coordination with the NBC local news about the racism and the treatment of the people there. And who authorized this? Uh, our our director here saw the, the envelope, he listened to the cassette, somebody call an Indian guy, you're a stupid dot head, and we have like an agreement with them, it's going to be broadcast to uh, Libya, Egypt, Afghanistan, uh, in America, Somalia, Ethiopia, Qatar, Morocco, all the places. We, we have like a big uh, story about this, so we want to get your side so it's not too much one-sided, you understand? They call somebody a butthead? No, a dot head. There is a recording of it too, so if you want to be stupid, it's not the best idea. Oh, 
Somebody here called somebody a dot head? Yeah. Al, did somebody call somebody a dot head? John, did somebody call somebody a dot head? No, no, I didn't hear anybody say that. Well, I got the two guys in front here. They said... Mm. So when do you want to come down? Well, we, we want to just get an interview and hear your side of the story, uh, but hopefully you won't deny it because there is a recording, so that, that, that would be a little bit of a, a shit show, if you will, if like you're saying, no, I did not say it, but there oh, is a recording. You say shit show? Uh, yes. No, don't ever use that word, shit show, with me. Why not? I, I'm speaking with you. Relax. Because that's that's not proper etiquette, shit show. Oh, that really? a shit show. Is, is dot head pro proper etiquette, you stupid? Well, I mean, I'm nobody here, nobody works here called anybody. It, your voice, sir, I am almost positive it was you, but if you want to say it was not, it's okay. The recording is safe. <laughs> I'm not me. I'm not, I very seldom answer the phone. I just okay. have to be it, standing there. It, it was a manager. Was it was a manager there who kept on, he refused to say sorry, number one. And number two, he was being just very, very rude to the guy, laugh at him, and it 100% happened. So we, we know that for a fact. Uh, so, I, and honestly, honestly, and, an and, and from the recording, it sounds like you, to be honest. But this is my no, opinion. It wasn't me. I mean, I'll be perfectly honest. It wasn't me. I don't, I don't, I don't use that phrase at all. Okay, well, 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 what happened is the guy called back asking for apology over and over and over again. The guy said he was playing stupid. He said, oh, I don't know who was this. I don't know. It did, did not happen here. I did not say that. And then the guy played back the recording to him. He still said, no, 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 it was not me and was being extremely stubborn. I don't know why anybody with any sense of business would be that stubborn to say sorry. It, it, it is literally mind blowing. So oh, if you had a, a date and a time, I could tell you exactly who was on the phone. It was January 28th. Well, I let a guy go last week that, uh, yeah, was not very customer friendly. I'm just wondering if it was him. Okay. Um, if you want to give me one second, I can maybe play it for you on the telephone. Uh, if you want to hear, uh, I can try to... That'd be excellent. I could recognize the voice. Okay. Well, one second, please. Let me see if I have it here, if I can transmit for you. Uh, I'm going to put you on hold for one minute while I go ahead and, and pull up the, rec uh, the recording for you. Is that okay? Very good. Very okay. good. Okay, one second. All of our representatives are currently busy. Please stay on the line, and your call will be answered by the next available representative. The estimated hold time is currently less than 96 minutes. You are currently caller number 32, waiting to speak with a representative. Thank you for your patience. Uh, hello? Yes, hello. Yes, hello. Okay, I believe we have it here. Let me uh, let me know if you can hear it okay. What, is, what does your mother look like? A dothead? A what? Did you hear it? it, it it's uh, honestly either... Do you have a brother or somebody related? Maybe it sounds very, very close to your voice. It's not me. It's definitely not me. Don't you have any part of the conversation? Or We have the full recording on the VHS cassette. We have to do like an exporting. I think I do recognize the voice, uh... I believe that is the gentleman that was let go. Uh, his name was uh, Samuel. Uh, he Samuel? Was there for about three weeks. When, when did you let him go, sorry? Uh, about two, oh, about maybe a week ago. When was, I think last Friday ago. Last, last Friday. I, I, I heard you say three weeks, then you said the two weeks, and then you said the one. Oh, he worked here. For, he only worked here for three weeks. Yeah. Okay, I can smell a bungeant smell of bullshit, but I'm coming right now. We will talk about it. Okay. Oh, okay. On on the way. <laughs> well, this guy's trying to cover his ass so hard. But why he say this to me, Tyrone? Hey, yo, don't worry. The new station's on top of it, dog. Don't cry. And there you have it, folks. We got that mother bitch with the art of reporting. This is Abdu from NBC News in coordination with Al Jazeera English. Signing out. Good night, Somalia. Oh, oh, yeah, and don't forget to share the video and make a subscribe if you enjoy. Oh, I saw your uh, advertisement on the uh, listing, Why right? Why do you keep calling?
calling me? What? Who are you? Hello? What are you talking about? Relax. I'm calling about Adver. Who are you? What are you? Oh my God! Relaxing, right? I don't know what happened here.